Hey, what's up, everybody? It's the Roberto Rodriguez from Detail Culture, and today I'm going to talk about cleaning your headlights. So, let's get into the video. So, the main reason why people want to clean their headlights is because, yes, these are clean right now, but over time, bugs going to get on them, dirt's going to get on them, and it depends on where you're at. Um, if it's just outside, like for me, I have a garage, which is okay, but then also I go to work 10 hours a day. So it's going to sit outside in the parking lot for 10 hours a day, and then sun beating on it, caking on it, with the dirt and the bugs. And then over time, it's going to get oxidized. It's going to have all these little spots in there. And bugs are very corrosive. Even on your front bumper and everything, or your front grill, all that shit, it's very corrosive. They'll eat through your clear coat as well. So that's why I want to tell people when I wash their cars for them, that, yeah, I'll have it clean, but I can only clean so much. I can get, get the bugs off, but it's, it's etched in the paint. There's nothing I can do to it unless I can polish it, which is probably going to cost you more. So this is a tip to keep your headlights clean for a lot longer. All right, so I'll show you how to do that. So right now I have this, this uh, Eco Clean Gen KO. This is a very nice cleaner. I fucking like this a lot. Uh, one of my favorite products from uh, IGL Coating. Um, so all you got to do is uh, you take your sprayer and you have a towel, wipe it down. And if you have bugs, uh, this is a Jersey bug rag, I believe, from uh, the rag company. So it's it's got this net uh, finish on the outside, which scrapes the bugs out, which is nice, and also has a microfiber side. So maybe if that's not too bad, you can probably use a microfiber tie and be good. But if you need to uh, really scrub some shit, then maybe use this. But my, my best advice is uh, if it's caked on there pretty well, it's been a while, maybe use a bug remover, which has some enzymes to break down bugs. But if you wash it every once in a while to keep your highlights clean, um, this is what you're going to want to use. So, so mine are not too bad. So all, all I need is just a cleaner and like a microfiber towel. And this one here is a 70-30 blend. So when you talk about blends, you talk about 70-30, your first number is going to be um, the polyester and then your second number is even polyamide and the polyamide is more expensive but it's going to be softer so you're going to want to want that more for your exterior um, surfaces like your paints um, exterior not too bad unless you got touch screen shit but otherwise that this would be good for your paint so you just want to spray this on here hold on there you go spray that on there may spray it small tell not a big deal and just kind of clean everything Get everything off, really good wipe down, and then take it to the other side, the dry side, and kind of buffer everything off. And you can see that really cleans my headlight. And that's what you're going to want. Um, so, the be um, best case scenario, if you want your headlights looking longer, get that shit ceramic coated. And that's a little last you the longest. And then all you do is take it like a pressure washer, wash it off, and she'll be good to go um so that's the best thing but you want to do with all your headlights like your these lights then you got your fog lights down below do it with your tail lights obviously not a big deal but um i understand people don't a lot of people don't maybe care about how their outside looks like because it's like a work truck or whatever but you gotta understand you're driving to work if i'm driving 30 miles um in the fucking sticks i got a lot of deer so i want to make sure i can see you know what i'm saying that's why i buy expensive headlights or bulbs in there so I can see so I can come home to my lady you know what I'm saying come home to my family I can come home every day knowing that I'm okay you know what I'm saying so that's why it's very important just to clean them up every once in a while and this right here I believe is like 16 bucks for for 16 ounces so if you're just cleaning your headlights every once in a while if you're just using it just for yourself and this is actually a really good deal because it probably lasts you a while but if you're more for like um you want more bang for your buck, you can get some uh, O&R out the no rinse. And you can do dilute that, like, uh, I believe you can do it, like, uh, with 32 ounces, I can mix, I think, 2 ounces with it. And it's like a detail spray, and they can do the exact same thing. Clean it up, get everything out of there. And like I said, if there's bugs on the stuck on it, you can't rub it off with a microfiber towel. Use one of these bug scrubber deals, scrape that shit right off, no problem. So... This is a tip for you to keep your headlights looking clean so they don't um, oxidize 
and get nasty over time. Do this maybe like once a month, you should be okay. And it'll last a long time. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys like it, comment, subscribe. I appreciate all that shit. So, and y'all have a blessed day. All right, catch you later.